Deluxus electric bike explorer uh, 26 inch wheels. Let's unbox this, see what's inside. Huge thanks to Deluxus for sending it over to me for the review. And you know guys, I'm gonna give an honest review. I'm not required to say anything. They just uh, give me a product to check it out, see what it's all about. Beautiful package. boxes in here. I'm 6'7", so it will be a little good test for 26 inches. Now the unboxing, nice box cutter will do the job. Very well packaged. There's a steering wheel. A little bit of assembly, that's it. Super minimum, looks like. Wow, that's a really thick tire for sure. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about that bag being in a shipment. Whoa, look at that, that's a battery. That's big. Just a couple more plastic right here, foam, and then set up. Okay, there's a box. What's inside? Instructional parts and tools. Beautiful. It comes with the Allen wrench. And the second box, the charger. Great. First and first, assemble the steering wheel. Down just like this. I love that tool. This flashlight goes down. So pretty simple. Four screws to more down here. Okay, now let's put the wheel on. Okay, most important, assembly. This disc goes into this way. And it locks in. Really nice that this comes with wrenches. And just tighten it up. Okay, looks like it's done. A little bit more assembly, just the pedals. There is a L and R, so left and right. Pretty easy. Nice. The flashlight adjustable, the speedometer is also adjustable. Okay guys, look at this beauty, wow. It's so thick, it's lots of batteries in there. Um, there's a chain. And look at that motor in the back. Wow, so awesome, really thick tires. Amazing. Looks like 55 pounds. Could be add on to here. Beautiful frame. So nice, I really like it. I'm 6'7", with really long legs. 220 pounds, wow, look at that. Probably will still have to adjust the seat a little higher, so I have a little bit stretchy legs. But this is most comfortable bike I've been on. That's amazing. 26 inch tires help a lot. Okay, just this adjustable, super easy. Ooh, too tall. I never thought my bike would be too tall. I want to be a little bit more comfortable. There you go. Wow, that is amazing. That is the most comfortable bike by far, being so tall. Okay, let's plug it in and then we're gonna take it out for a run. And super simple, the plug will be right here to charge it. It has a plug, sign on it, and the key will be right here. Pretty awesome. Looks like I don't have to cut this off because it's holding these wires. Just into a wall plug and lock it in, nice. Right at this point, meaning charging, it will turn green when it's charged. Alright guys, I'll do the test. Let's make a little circle and try to get to uh, high speed, at least 25 miles. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Ooh, there's a seat. So 
Now this is amazing. Right now it was set at 19 miles an hour fastest. It's amazing. There is a speedometer, and I could have went faster, but I think it's set for like uh, less speed. Also, there is a power assist. Whenever I start kicking pedals, it actually speeds up a little bit. So if I do you hear it? The motor just kicks in. And there is a button right here. If I push it, it goes up to, looks like 21 miles an hour right here at the speedometer. And there's assist one. If I press one, full, there is bars go up. So 21 miles an hour. But I'm 230 pounds and it was easily going um, 19 miles an hour. Okay, so two, three, four, five. Okay, let's see on fight. 21 miles an hour, nice. So pretty hard. Look at the pedals and the tire. This is assist five. As you can see, it's really fast. That's amazing. Miles, average miles per hour, max. Whoa, ma max, uh, uh, I guess the max I could reach. Beautiful. Time, colors, and other stuff. Power or something. Love it. Traxxas e-bike, that was really fun, that was my first impression, first time riding it. Let's get into some specification, we'll test it one more time. So, the speeds right here is, uh, if you're using throttle, it's only go up to 21 miles per hour, that's it. If we go on with the pedals power assist, it goes up on the first uh, uh, 10 miles an hour, then on to like 15. And this is power assist zero. No assist at all. Okay. Power assist one. Then power assist two. 15 miles an hour clipped in. Power assist a 19 hours and 21. Power assist 4, do you hear that? 24 miles an hour. And power assist, do you hear that? 36. Okay, power 1. Pretty quickly, 11 miles an hour. 2, 15 miles an hour. 3, you see assist 3. 21, 4, 5. looks like 24, something like that, and 5, 36 on maximum. Also, Traxxas e buy battery life should have between 30 to 60 uh, miles. And it's all depending how much we will be using the uh, power assist and also a little bit of how much of a weight you have. I'm 220 pounds, so it probably will affect the battery life compared to much lighter person as well. And also depending on the terrain too. If it's more of a flat terrain, it'll last a little bit longer compared to climbing uphill all the time using the power assist as well. There's a few different things. So this is with the throttle. The more I push, the more it's speeding up. And it goes up to 21 miles an hour. Right now we're going at 10. Okay, let's get to 10 miles an hour. 20, 15. So power assist on one, it goes 10 out miles an hour then I'll have to use those things so zero 
then I put on two, it kicks in. A little bit faster. And on three, it will be even faster. Woo! Kicks in really good and so on. It'll just kick in even more. And last kick, I kick in the pedals, but it's not going faster. Or I can use a throttle, it goes up even faster. So with the pedals, it would go a lot faster with, than with the throttle. That's awesome. I assist five, it's just kicking. It just want to take off on me. With the assist, assist zero, I'll have to do all the work. Assist one definitely helps a little bit. Assist, assist five, it just want to kick, even on two. It's nice. And I can use a throttle. Pretty awesome. It's nice to have an option to have such a good power to go up the hill. Sometimes it's uh, nice to have a lot more power to get you up the hill. Also, there is a light. Let's turn on the light. Uh, it will dim. When the light is on, light is right here on, up and down. You can almost see. And the lights in the back will illuminate. That is cool, okay. Traxxas C bike has even the light in the back that is connected to a brake. When we hold it, it will flicker on both sides. That is so awesome. Yeah, definitely can be seen from far away. Nice reflectors. They go, Traxxas C bike. I definitely going to use it. Recommended myself. So glad to get one of these huge thanks to Traxxas for sending it over to me and make this video possible. That's amazing.